Hello and welcome to Chill's Roll. So today we're gonna play Broken Age. This is a very new game. Um, and it's a point and click adventure game. Though it's uh, it's very special in its own little way. I mean the artwork in this game, it is fucking fantastic. And I'm not gonna say anything than the characters are saying anything in the game. Because I really think that would ruin everything. So I'm not gonna say shit. Ooh. Hey, rise and shine, son. You better get up. I'm almost off duty. Mom's gonna be here soon, and you know how she is. Oops, here she comes. Have a great day, Shane. There's my little angel. Oh, computer, snooze. No more snoozies for my little spaceman this morning. Oh, I hope no bad tinkle fairies came and wet your bed during the night. <laughs> oh, computer, off. Come on and get up, Shay. Lots of important adventures to go on today. Get up now, Mr. Man, or I'll turn on the mean sound. Okay, you asked for it. Is this the mean sound? Oh, I, I can actually get out. Oh. What a good boy. Oh. Okay, let's clean up that dirty little body. Man, he really fucking hates the snack. Hey, easy, computer. Oh, quit being so shy. I used to change your diaper. What's the difference? Uh, man. Holy shit, he's just fucking depressed with his life. Sure. What difference does it make? Wow. Good oh, morning, oh. Commander Shane. Yeah. I wonder if this bowl is as sick of cereal as I am. So just pick me up and we'll start filling you up with space Can I clean anything else? I can't. Yes! You won't be sorry, Commander. Oh, here we go. Once more into the Milky Breach. It's happening. It's really happening. Now, sir, I don't just serve food. I also serve up nutrition facts and eating encouragement. For instance, that last spoonful was exactly 7.1 calories. Did you? Uh oh. Uh, Commander? Aren't you excited to see what the big deal is? Up on the bridge? No? Well then, want to know the viscosity of this morning's synthetic milk? You, synthetic milk? Okay, computer. What's the big emergency? I wish you'd call me mom, sweetie. I wish you called me Captain, computer. Okay, Captain, sweetie. Let's get down to business. We are currently tracking multiple developing crises that need urgent attention. First of all, a massive avalanche has been reported on the planet Galactica. Second, there's a runaway train in System 7 that's headed for Spike Canyon. We've also received a Mayday signal from the vessel Friendship Circle. They're under attack. And, uh-oh, this just came in. My sensors are reporting an entity of unknown origin has attached itself to the hull of this very ship. What are your orders, sweet uh, Captain? Oh man, that computer is so cute. They just gotta grab my clock because then I won't like to be able to know how long I've been recording. So what should we take? Got to defend the friendship, to defend friendship circle. Oh, I just don't know who would attack those poor defenseless cuties. To the teleporter room. It's pretty funny that the ship has been made for a baby. I'm aboard the distressed vessel Friendship Circle. I found one of the crew. So I suppose this game is pretty much made for all. For all uh, age groups. What happened here? There was an attack! From an enemy vessel? 
or an alien creature? Or did you attack yourselves in a fit of space madness? Yes. Jesus, man. Got a special nutrition paste for you today. Oh, not sure what this one is. <sighs> he really fucking hates his life. Ready for your next exciting space mission, honey? We've got an avalanche, a runaway train, a spaceship under attack, and a mysterious Oh, so it's just the same? The, hull. the same missions, I guess. What's the thing on the hall? Better suit up and investigate that foreign body. Oh, I don't like you going out there. Let's use the safety suit. Ah, oh, come on. Oh yeah, did I actually mention that uh, this whole project was actually funded on the Kickstarter campaign? Like, it, it has so fucking much excess, excess money after it was done. Okay, I'm outside the ship. The foreign body must be very close by. Was it like candy? Or Oh, I, I, I suppose this might actually not be a a uh, like simulator one. I found the object. It appears to be something organic in nature. Something's telling me I should stick my face right into it. Ah! Get off of me! Get off! Oh. You're going to love this dinner pill. Leftovers medley. Okay, so everything is made as good as possible in that ship. What mission should we go on next, sweetie? So is this just a infinite loop? Is, is this a game? I mean... What about the Let's catch train? that runaway train! I, I guess aye, aye, you gotta... Captain, sweetie, to system <laughs> 7. I, I, I guess you gotta, like, fuck it up so you can... Uh, Get, get a progression in the story. I can click on it again. Wake up, bridge man. Oh, I see. Man. Let's fuck Sorry, it up. What are you doing? That's not right. Ah! Why are you doing? Ah! Shane! What were you thinking? You could have saved us so easily. I'm sure you had to be there. <laughs> oh, he's just really fucking happy that it's something different. 18 years of the, those fucking missions. I understand that shit. Having fun? Huh? Who are you? When you tire of child's play, when you're ready for real danger, come see me. But tell no one. Do you understand? Okay. But no one. Hey, wait! What? Not got yet touchy at all. No discussion about it, young man. You need to rest and heal up in bed until further notice. Computer, I'm fine. Obviously. No, you might have a delayed fracture. That can happen. No, it can't. All missions are cancelled. I love you. <sighs> she is so fun, sweet. Weird. 
No missions. I can do whatever. Indeed, Sonny boy. So I, I suppose I can. She says it's a humidifier, but I think it's some sort of mind control device. There's an air tank attached to the top of it. Oh, let's see. It's that. a tank of compressed air. Could be useful. Come on. Oh. Puppy, puppy, puppy. Oh look, it's another Grab and Gary robot. Can't wait to put it in the trash. I mean, my collection. Can I instruct this? Like, oh, oh, no, 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 no. How about this? Hmm. The air vent is screwed shut. It looks like a weird little screwdriver. Oh, here we go. It works. Hmm. What's this? It looks like an inflatable raft. It looks like an inflatable raft. Oh, we can just can, can we combine this shit? It's a tank of compressed air. Maybe oh, this can. air tank has enough pressure to blow up this raft. Whoa! It looks like a blow up doll of me. Creepy. Not at all. Not at all. So I suppose I gotta. Gotta put this guy in the bed. Hopefully, this looks enough like me to fool the warden. So what now? Can we uh, escape? Oh, that's not creepy at all. You know what? Can I? Oh, I can actually go down there. Where's my little angel? Oh. There he is. Oh, I think I almost lost you today. Sleep tight, little hero. Wow, she's pretty damn stupid. Man, computers are stupid. I concur! Man, that wolf guy fucking looks creepy. Whoa. How have I never seen this part of the ship before? You came. Because you are done with children's games. Yes. Who are you? My name is Marek, and what I'm about to show you is no game. While you've been drifting through the universe, eating ice cream, playing with trains, war has been raging across the galaxy. War? Between who? Between the forces that every war is between. Between the powerful and the weak. The tyrants and the innocent. But who? Does it even matter? There will always be war. We did not start it, and we cannot stop it. What we can do is protect the weak and rescue the helpless. Look at this distress signal I just received from a peaceful colony in the Talon Nebula. The helpless creatures you see have been imprisoned by forces of tyranny and may soon be executed. But... Yes? We... We have to save them. Yes. Yes, we do. Well, that's really something I'm off this pleased guy. you feel as such. We have to go tell the ship's computer. No. You must tell no one on this ship what I have just told you. This ship is programmed with one function. To keep you safe. Yeah, I noticed that. To help these creatures, you will need to put yourself at risk in a way she could never understand. No, you're right. She would never understand. So what can we do? First, we have to get to the Talon Nebula. Take this star chart to the navigation room. I have an earpiece for you to wear so we can stay in contact. Use that vent to avoid detection. Return immediately after you're successful. But. Quickly, young cub, we don't have much time. Okay. Oh, I can actually... Oh, I can skip. Ah, the young master has come to play with the space weaver. Where shall we go today, wise commander? Oh, man. A real mission for once. This is so fun. This is serious, Shay. Stay focused. You can hear everything I say? Yes. Please don't say anything embarrassing. Okay, here we go. Like that shit in. Hey, Space Weaver, can you take me here? With pleasure. Oh. 
So what can I actually do? Looks like the Space Weaver has encoded the star chart into a graph of nits and pearls. Man, I really fucking like this artwork though. Knitting to true space. So scientific. Great. We should be in the Talon Nebula now. Great work, young cub. We're approaching the location of the distress signal now. <gasps> this is worse than I thought. The good news is their captors have left them unguarded for the time being. What can I do? Here, take these controls. You need to lower the shield oh, the so the boom arms can be extended. Oh, yeah. Good. Now wait until the boom arm is correctly positioned. I got it! Great work, Shay. Now the boom arms will haul it in and place it in the auxiliary cargo hold. I should go see if it's okay. No. They must remain in complete quarantine for their own protection. And ours. You mean our diseases might kill them? You are wise for such he is a young fucking cop. Full of shit. Now we must save more quickly before their captors return. Use the movement controls to position the ship. I am pretty sure we're actually kidnapping these, these guys. Wait for it. Got another one. Great. Now just place it in the cargo hold and... Oh no. What is it? Hostile forces have been detected nearby. They're coming in our direction. We need to retreat. Not yet. There's still one more to save. No time. We have to pull out immediately or we'll be destroyed. No! You didn't tell me I'd have to pick who lived and died. You want to be a grown-up? Get used to making tough decisions. No time to mourn. There's another distress signal. This one's from... Danger System 5. Are you Danger up to Danger System 5? What the fuck is Are you the master of your feelings or are they the master of you? Best names. Give me the star chart. Let's do this shit. Skip it. Hey, Space Weaver. Let's go somewhere exciting for a change. I have been programmed to take the young master wherever he desires, as long as it is safe and free of conflict. Ah. Bring me a star chart, and the fabric of time and space shall be knit to serve your passage. Yeah, this makes no sense. Can I? Can I actually? Hey, Space Weaver, can you take me here? Not a problem. But the system is called Danger System. But, but it, is, it, it doesn't really sound very safe though. Can we think? Oh, we can actually just skip this here. Nice, nice. This looks like the place. Thank you. Okay, we should be in Danger System 5. Are we ever? Take a look at this. Oh. What is up with this shit? I suppose it got some like Excellent. heavy implement on the story. But I really think we're actually kidnapping Careful. this shit. Great work! When it comes to choosing a creature, you must trust your instinct. Good. But hurry, we're running out of time. Wait for it. Oh, here we go. Okay, that's enough. What do you mean, that's enough? 
I mean, enemy ships are approaching. I don't see anything. I need to save this last one. You're going to endanger the whole mission to save one creature? Just give me a second. The America's really This is a waste of time. Super full of no shield. For this. Here we go. Okay, I got it. But something's wrong. Cut it loose. We need to retreat before. Attention, ship is under attack. Oh. What happened? Probably one of the enemy vessels I warned you about. Remember? We need to get that last creature. So the creature actually. The ship is retreating under autopilot to a safe location. And we're completely locked out of the controls. Yeah. How are we going to perform any more rescues? We'll have to find another way to hack into the boom arm controls. And another way to bring the shields down at the right time. And who knows if we'll be able to navigate to the right system now that the ship's on high alert. The ship's computer must be freaking out right now. Oh, yes. <laughs> As soon as the alarm sounded, the first thing she probably did was check on you and your... So the creature actually, uh, tried to resist it. Shay! Shay! Are you hurt? Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> Don't worry, sweetie. Um, something attacked the ship, but Mommy's taking care of it. Nothing to worry about, okay? Ah, <laughs> oh, so brave. Whew. Better get back to Merrick to hear his plan. Man, what the fuck is going on? So, I really can't guess what those arms actually... So, what, what, what could it be? I mean, he's obviously full of shit. But, uh, I, I am 100% sure that we are actually kidnapping these creatures. Hmm. Any luck with the ship's controls? No, but we intercepted a new distress signal, this time from Prima Doom. Prima Doom, wow. That sounds super safe. So, how long have you been living in here? I am a recent stowaway. I came because I sensed you are ready. Are you really a wolf? No, I wear this disguise to blend in with your other stuffed animal friends. Weird. Holy shit, he is 100% fucking... So, that's full a of wolf shit? suit? What are you underneath i am what i do a rescuer of creatures in need just like you how are we going to get control of the ship's cargo boom arms we'll need to attempt a manual override the manual boom arm controls are located here you can get to them through the ship's airlock here i've hacked the airlock door so you can now open it without alerting the over mother how are we going to take down the shields? I have a plan. The shields require so much power, they have a dedicated source. This fusion orb. Take this Omicron inhibitor and place it over the fusion orb. And when the time is right, we'll turn it on and turn off the fusion orb. Along with the ship's shields. Got it. The distress call was from Prima Doom? How do we get there? Same as always, take this star chart to the Space Weaver and hope for the best. Hmm. Alright. Why do I have to be the one to choose who to rescue? A boy your age just has good instincts for the job. I'd better get back to the mission. Yes, he is. our window of opportunity won't last forever. I, I really can't wait to see what's actually going on. Oh yeah, this is uh, actually in, in like Axe, much like in Walking Dead. Where are so we? It's, it's the same place as always, the center of the universe. Really? Wherever the young master is, that is the center of our universe. Oh, you? Oh, 
That's a lot. We need to go here right away. Prima Doom. Negative. The bat system is forbidden due to likelihood of hostile activity. But it's an emergency. Sometimes safety is the most exciting adventure of all. Might I suggest somewhere safer? Like Puppy Planetoid, Cozy Cluster, or maybe somewhere in the Smile System? <laughs> Fucking Smile System? Uh. Fuck it. Merrick. The Space Weaver won't make a nav scarf for Prima Doom. Hmm. How are your knitting skills? Oh, so you can actually knit it before he actually goes off in the trial. I'd better get back to the mission. Yes. Ah, I, I Our see, window of I opportunity see. won't last forever. So I, 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 gotta, I gotta find an item to do that, I, I suppose. I suppose. The helpless creatures we rescued are being quarantined in there. Wish I could let them out. But it's for their own safety, I guess. Judging by the wolf hair, this must be where Merrick sleeps. Hmm. Oh, he's like repairing the, the little bell. That's cool. Wait, hey, the helmet comes off. Ah, else you I made a hexy power. I wonder what's in those creepy jars. My old tea? Teleporter, activate. May I teleport you to the Nexus? See, see. No malfunction, no malfunction, no malfunction. <laughs> oh, that is really comforting. Hey, my... my head. What's wrong? My head is... smaller. Oh, uh, yeah, you just used a teleporter. Why did my head shrink? Quantum physics, duh. Don't worry, it'll all go back to normal when you take the trip back through me. Big baby. That, uh, that can't be healthy. Teleporter, activate. This way to the fusion oh, containment facility. It is going smooth, and I just gotta end this little episode right here.